One of the aspects of that lawsuit was that P. Diddy had surveillance footage in his property. Wait, wait, look real quick. What is yep. this, Jesse? Because these are new pictures. So if that are is, these the, there's that people could in be his sons. Now. That could be his sons. That could be his sons. Again, if, if that is accurate, I wouldn't be surprised because the allegations put forward in that lawsuit implicated his sons in uh, different criminal so, activities. So these are aerial photos from our helicopter in Los Angeles. It's zoomed in now. This is brand new. In recent times, there's been a lot of buzz around the famous rapper P. Diddy. The situation got really intense when the federal government decided to raid all of his properties. But that's not the only heat Diddy's facing. Right now, he's also dealing with a bunch of lawsuits. It seems like they just keep coming, one right after the other making it look like there's no end in sight. What's even more shocking is that one of these lawsuits also involves his son, Justin Combs. This news took everyone by surprise, including Justin, who's now taking steps to clear his name from this lawsuit. Interestingly, there are whispers and rumors going around suggesting Justin might be sharing information about his dad to get his name cleared. These rumors of him possibly snitching on Diddy are stirring up quite the conversation. So let's dive deeper into what's going on. Justin Combs is widely recognized as Diddy's oldest son. Recently, he found himself caught in a serious situation that directly involved his father. In a shocking turn of events, Justin, at the age of 29, was named alongside his dad, Diddy, who is 54, in a lawsuit that has raised eyebrows across the board. This particular lawsuit, brought forward by music producer Rodney Lil Rod Jones, throws around the terms a staggering 50 times, putting both father and son under a harsh spotlight. On the afternoon of March 25th, a significant event unfolded at Diddy's sprawling properties in Los Angeles and Miami. Federal agents, as part of a broader investigation into allegations involving Diddy, descended upon these locations. Amidst this dramatic scene, Justin Combs and his younger brother, King Combs, who is 25, found themselves caught up in the raid of the California home. Breaking news, the Department of Homeland Security has just confirmed to CNN that federal law enforcement agents have raided properties owned by musician and producer Sean Diddy Combs. The scene was tense, with both brothers detained by Homeland Security. Despite the gravity of the situation and the swirling accusations, the specifics of their detention remained unclear. Yet, in a turn of events, both Justin and King were released without any charges. Following their release, the rumor mill started churning. Whispers suggested that perhaps Justin and King had shared information about Diddy and the ongoing case to secure their freedom. This added a new layer of complexity and intrigue to an already tangled situation. The day the federal agents arrived at Diddy's mansion was charged with tension, with law enforcement digging into serious concerns tied to Diddy, the presence of his sons, handcuffed and sitting on the grass outside, made for a compelling visual narrative. Observers could only watch as the drama unfolded, broadcasted for all to see. One of the aspects of that lawsuit was that P. Diddy had surveillance footage in his property. Wait, wait, look real quick. What is yep. this, Jesse? Because these are new pictures. So if that are is, these the ki there's that people could in be his sons. Now. That could be his sons. That could be his sons. Again, if, if that is accurate, I wouldn't be surprised because the allegations put forward in that lawsuit implicated his sons in uh, different criminal so, activities. So these are aerial photos from our helicopter in Los Angeles. It's zoomed in now. This is brand new. Homeland Security Investigations, which is leading the operation, has announced their involvement in a major investigation. The operation involved teams from New York, Los Angeles, and Miami, as well as local law enforcement. They promised more information as the situation progressed, leaving the public and the media eager for more information. Amidst this chaos, the whereabouts of Diddy himself became a point of speculation. He was reportedly seen pacing out the Miami airport, a considerable distance from the unfolding drama at his properties. His private jet had landed in Antigua, adding another layer of mystery to the day's events. Photos obtained by ABC News capturing Combs' Love Air Jet in Antigua. No information about who, if anyone, was on the plane. In the aftermath, King and Justin were seen gathering their belongings, which appeared to indicate a desire to distance themselves from the chaos surrounding their father. This action suggested that they intended to take a step back from the chaos, possibly even to leave the situation entirely. The decision to potentially leave the controversy behind and move away from everything that was going on demonstrated Diddy's family's profound reaction to the events of that day. But why was Justin Combs tied into all of this in the first place? Well, it all starts with a serious lawsuit filed against his dad, Diddy, by music producer Rodney Lil Rod Jones. In this lawsuit, Justin finds himself named as a defendant, which has stirred up quite the drama around the family. According to the details of the suit, a major incident that brought Justin into the spotlight was an altercation in a recording studio. During this event, it's alleged that either Diddy or Justin Combs was involved in shooting a man known only as G. This accusation alone is pretty heavy and adds to the complexity of the legal battles Diddy is facing. The lawsuit, which was filed back in February, accuses Diddy of some really serious stuff. Jones is asking for $30 million because he says Diddy messed with him over a period that lasted more than a year. Jones claims he went through these horrible experiences in several places, like Diddy 
Cities homes in Florida, Los Angeles, New York, and even on a yacht in the U.S. Virgin Islands. Adding to the gravity of these accusations, Jones says that while he was living with Diddy, he managed to record evidence of Diddy doing illegal things with his friends and colleagues. Justin Combs getting dragged into this lawsuit, especially with the claim of his presence during such a critical incident, really shines a light on how serious the accusations against Diddy are. His temporary detention, despite being released without charges, certainly didn't help matters. It just adds more layers to the already complicated and dramatic legal struggles the family is going through. Then there's the drama and rumors about Justin not even being Diddy's biological son. The talk of the town that Anthony Wolf Jones, Diddy's late bodyguard, might actually be Justin's real dad. This buzz isn't exactly new, but it's been getting a lot of attention again because of all the other stuff going down with Diddy. Reggie Wright Jr. in an interview pointed out that Justin looks a lot like Wolf, not so much like Diddy. People have always whispered about how Justin and Wolf share a striking resemblance, much more than Justin and Diddy. It's kind of hard not to notice, especially when folks bring it up time and again. Folk Diddy bodyguard Wolf, you made a comment a while ago and you said that um, Misa, she was messing around with him. I didn't say that, did I? I just put up two pictures. I put up a picture of Wolf and one of Puffy's sons. Justin Combs. Look at him. You tell me. You tell me. Look at the two pictures. They on bomb first. Pull them up. You pull them up. They on the internet. Put a picture of Wolf up and put a picture. But Gene, deny you ever told me that, Gene. Adding more fuel to this fire, there's been a bit of a history lesson pulling everyone back to the late 90s. That's when Wolf was the main man protecting Diddy. They were together during a wild night in 1999 at a New York City club, a night that ended in a shooting scandal. Wolf, Diddy, and rapper Shine were all caught in the mess, but when the dust settled, only Shine ended up in jail, thanks to some questionable moves by Diddy, or so the rumors say. Wolf stayed loyal to Diddy through thick and thin, even when Diddy started hanging out with Big Meech from the notorious Black Mafia family. That loyalty, some say, might have been what led to Wolf's tragic end. And with Wolf gone, whispers started swirling about Diddy's relationship with the Black Mafia family and all sorts of shady deals. But here's where it gets personal. Justin, born to Misa Hilton, Diddy's high school sweetheart in 1993, has been at the center of this whirlwind of speculation. Despite Diddy's rocky relationship with Misa, marked by allegations of control and infidelity, the questions about Justin's paternity have lingered. Misa, admired for her beauty and her early involvement in Diddy's life, has recently been dropping hints that might suggest there's truth to the rumors about Justin's real dad. Fans and followers can't help but piece together the puzzle, especially when looking at how similar Justin and Wolf look. It's a story filled with drama, loyalty, scandal, and now, a paternity question that seems to be on everyone's mind. So, if Diddy isn't even Justin's real dad, the talk about Justin sharing info on Diddy gets really interesting. Think about it, if the rumors are true and Justin's actual father was Diddy's bodyguard, Wolf, things start to make a different kind of sense. Justin finding out he's not biologically Diddy's son could change a lot for him. It's like, if he's been living with this big secret, maybe he doesn't feel is tied to Diddy, that could explain why you might decide to talk about stuff Diddy wouldn't want getting out. Imagine growing up and then learning your dad might not really be your dad, that's huge. And if that dad is someone as famous as Diddy, with all these secrets and drama, you might start feeling confused about where your loyalty should be. It's not just about family anymore, it's about figuring out what feels right to you. So, the idea of Justin maybe sharing secrets about Diddy isn't just about snitching, it's more about Justin trying to deal with a bunch of complicated feelings and maybe wanting to do what he thinks is right. It puts the whole rumor into a new light, making it more about Justin trying to find his own way in a really mixed up situation. So, what's next for Diddy and Justin Combs? Things are getting pretty heated with all the legal stuff hanging over them. Justin is still wrapped up in this lawsuit, and if things don't go his way, he could end up in jail. Yeah, you heard that right. Jail time is a real possibility if he's found guilty in the lawsuit. And Diddy? Well, if he's found guilty in his own troubles, he's looking at jail time too. Now, about the whole snitching thing, if Justin really did share some serious info about Diddy, then Diddy could be in big trouble. It's like, if Justin told the authorities something that proves Diddy did something wrong, then Diddy's chances of staying out of jail get slimmer. Imagine this, you're in a boat together, and if one person starts drilling holes in the boat, both of you are going to sink. That's kind of what might happen here. If Justin's information is big enough, it could really shake things up for Diddy. But it's not just about the legal stuff, there's also the whole father and son relationship to think about. If Justin did share info, what does that mean for him and Diddy? 
Diddy. Can they fix things? Or is it going to be super awkward at family dinners? In the end, both Diddy and Justin are facing some tough times ahead. They've got to deal with the court stuff, sure, but they also have to figure out where they stand with each other. No matter what happens next, it's going to be a bumpy ride. What do you make of all this drama? Do you believe Justin Combs really spilled the beans on Diddy? Or is it all just gossip? And who do you think is Justin's real dad? Is it Diddy? Or could it actually be Wolf? We're super curious to hear your thoughts, so drop a comment below and let us know what you think.